A meteorite that crashed to Earth a decade ago, was part of a long-lost planet that formed in the early solar system, just a few million years after the birth of the Sun. The Almohada Sita meteorite, which contains microscopic diamonds, come from a mysterious embryonic planet that once circled the Sun 4.5 billion years ago, experts say. The celestial body, which was slightly larger than Mercury, was destroyed in an epic cosmic collision. As well as being extremely valuable, the rare diamonds provide scientists with a tantalizing window into the formation of planets. Tens of these budding worlds, which were generally between the size of the Moon and Mars, smashed into each other to form the rocky planets we see today. The Almohada Sita is named after the location in Sudan, above which the space rock exploded in 2008. Witnesses at the town of Wadi Halfa, and at a railway stop in the Nubian Desert, known as Station 6 or Almohada Sita in Arabic, reported they had seen a rocket-like fireball in the sky. This extremely rare type of meteorite, known as an Uri light, is one of the main families of meteorites and range from few grams up to few kilograms. The diamonds in the meteorite have tiny crystals inside them, that would have required great pressure to form. The parent planetary body from which they formed, is believed to have been catastrophically disrupted by an impact, during the first 10 million years of the solar system. There are over 480 meteorites that are classified as Uralites, lead researcher Dr. Ferhang Nebier from the Swiss Federal Institute of Technology in Lausanne, told Mail Online. There are many meteorites coming from Mars or the Moon. However, this specific protoplanet has been destroyed in the early solar system and that is unique so far. Planetary formation simulations suggest that they were tens of planetary embryos, in the size range between that of Moon and that of Mars in the early solar system. The Swiss-led team behind the find used a powerful scanning technique, called transmission electron microscopy. They examined tiny crystals embedded within diamonds in the meteorite, to make the discovery. The study showed the diamonds must have formed at pressures above 20 gigapascals, or 197,385 times the pressure of Earth's atmosphere at sea level. This is equivalent to billions of tons of rock pushing down from above, crushing forces so high they must have happened on a Mercury to Mars-sized protoplanet. Dr. Nabier added, planetary formation models show terrestrial planets, are formed by the accretion of tens of Moon to Mars-sized planetary embryos, through energetic giant impacts. However, relics of these large protoplanets are yet to be found. Nearly 50 fragments of the 83-ton asteroid, were collected from the desert in northern Sudan, where it fell in October 2008. The bus-sized lump of rock was first detected by astronomers in the U.S., and made headlines as it was tracked by telescopes around the world. It eventually disintegrated in the atmosphere above the Nubian Desert, posing no threat to human life. Researchers studied a section of the Almohada Sita Uri light, where large diamonds were formed at high pressure inside their parent planet. We discovered chromite, phosphate, and sulfide inclusions embedded in the diamond, said Dr. Nabier. The composition and morphology of the inclusions can only be explained, if the formation pressure was higher than 20 gigapascals. Such pressures suggest that the Uri light parent body was a Mercury to Mars-sized planetary embryo. The researchers said, these types of meteorites are the last remaining remnants of this lost planet. An extensive ground search turned up 47 meteorite fragments for analysis. The historic event, the first time such an object has been followed in this way, will boost our chances of avoiding a future catastrophe like the asteroid strike that wiped out the dinosaurs. Almohada Sita was traveling at an estimated 27,739 miles per hour, until it disappeared into the planet's shadow, and was then observed as it exploded in a fireball as bright as a full moon. Dr. Nabier said, although this is the first compelling evidence for such a large body that has since disappeared, their existence in the early solar system has been predicted by planetary formation models. This study provides convincing evidence the Uri like parent body, was one such large lost planet before it was destroyed by collisions. The full findings were published in the journal Nature Communications.